What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of The Wiley Show. I am your host, Wiley, and we are back with a new video. Now, I'm doing this because we got some updated information uh, about Angela Yee and the whole Breakfast Club situation. But Angela Yee blocked Malago Graham, so we're going to talk about that and dive into that. But let me first talk about the Ma Wiggin Show saying that I should not be on Jack. Apparently, one of his supporters sent him a copy of my picture of my Jack profile and sent it to him because he said, uh, I'll be being on Jack. Now, mind you, I am on Jack. I've been on Jack for years. Sometimes I've, I've been on Jack for years. Now, I'm not really meeting nobody on Jack right now because of the whole monkey pox. So I'm not on, I'm on, I'm not on Jack right now because of the monkey or meeting people off of Jack right now because of monkey pox. But I, I like Jack. I think Jack is a great site. I've met some good people, met some good friends. Uh, on Jack that I'm still cool with. I met some good people on, on Jack, met some subscribers um, on Jack. So I think Jack is a good site. And it's not always about, you know what I'm saying, having sex. You know, you can meet up with people on Jack and have a smoking session where you just smoke. But mind you, because of monkeypox, I'm not really meeting nobody on there. But I'm like, why is the Armand Wicked Show so concerned of me being on Jack? Why is his people sending him messages saying that Wiley is on Jack? Why are they so concerned? Because usually I thought that they don't watch the Wiley Show, they're not checking for the Wiley Show. If you saw my profile, you could have easily blocked me and not respond. Now, the person didn't have no messages because if you send me foolishness telling me to send you pictures of my private parts, I will immediately block you because I don't play no games. I'm not sending you pictures on my private area or on my Jack. You will immediately be blocked. You will be immediately blocked from the platform. So I'm not doing that. But I was so like, I'm like, wow, they so concerned. Dina Ma said, he shouldn't be on Jack. He shouldn't do that. Why is he on Jack? First of all, you in a whole relationship which you probably control your man, okay? I'm on Jack. I'm free to do it. I'm free to go to the bath house. I'm free to do all these things. Once you're single, you're free to do a lot of stuff. But I, like, again, for the people that's in here, I've been on BGC one time when that was popping. Um, I'm, I have a Tinder account as well. well. I meet females. I'm on I'm on Tinder. And then, of course, I'm on Jack. And I appreciate all the apps. But those apps is not always designed for you to be having sex. I think people think that you're on there just for sex. You could be on there to meet somebody for a book club, hanging up, or meeting somebody to go to the museum, meeting somebody to go to the club with, et cetera. And then I use it, really a little secret, I use it to promote like my YouTube. I send a clip out to all the people in my area that I do YouTube. And then also it's a little feature, a little promotion feature on Jack where you can actually send the picture to random people in other country, not other country, I'm sorry, in other states. And you can do that. And it's a good promotion thing. And also across the country and a well across the world. So that's what I do. And that's what I'm doing as well. So I'm just saying this. Listen, I'm just going to be real, real with you on here. Okay. Uh, when you have issues and problems with the Wally show and you don't like them, you know, Hey, just block me because I'm everywhere. I'm on Jack. I'm on Tinder. I'm on uh, Plenty of Fish. It's just it's everywhere. I'm just everywhere, and I use it to really to network uh, my show, so I don't see nothing wrong. Now, now I want to talk about a um, little quickly here uh, about Hillary Clinton. Y'all know who Hillary Clinton is. She had ran for office. She was married to President Bill Clinton, and I just want to just talk about this lady how she is just trolling how she is just trolling the Trumps with this because back in the day, they were saying lock her up because of her emails. Now she released a tweet and she said every, but her emails, hat or shirt, so so helps onward together partners defend democracy, build a progressive, uh, uh, build a pro progressive bench and fight for our values, just saying. So she got a hat that she's selling, but her email. So I'm really, really here for this whole thing with Hillary Clinton, you know, trolling the Republicans because they have always, especially Trump saying, lock her up. What about those 33,000 emails? And that was extremely funny when they was running for office. Extremely, extremely funny when they was when uh, when Trump was running for office. It's really, really fun. So I'm, I will be buying me a hat. I'm definitely going to buy me a hat. 
uh, I will be doing that, and I will be rocking it on the Wally Show. Okay, that's what exactly what I'm be doing. Now, I got to talk about Angela Yee. Okay, and of course, we did a live last night. And we talked about the Breakfast Club breaking up. Now, that's not all the way accurate. Angela Yee will have her own radio syndicated show, uh, her national syndicated show. She will be branching out on her own. Now, when we come to this show. Uh, with Angela Yee, I'm super excited. I'm a huge fan of Angela Yee, and I and, and and once you listen to the Breakfast Club, like the entire show, she do a lot of talking. She's so entertaining. And she and she's funny. Now I'm happy, but dear Malago Graham, a loud mouth, uh, Malago Graham said something that was derogatory or nasty towards Angela Yee, and Angela Yee blocked her. Maybe it's because of Malago Graham standing up for um for Tory Lanez, which was Tory Lanez, Pop Megan, and the Pinky Toe. I don't know, but she had got blocked, and Malago Grants was like, F you too. I'm like, whoa. But the question I was trying to dig up the tweets and be like, what did Malago Graham say to get blocked? So I'm really trying to research that. And this happened on last night. I'm like, this is something. I'm like, what did Malago Graham say to get blocked from Angelia? If I know anything about Malago Graham, she said something nasty, something trashy, like she said out of her mouth. And I think that she's jealous of Angelia because she will never be able to get to sit with. Charlemagne the guy and DJ Envy, just like maybe, maybe she'll be able to sit on the lap of Toy Lanes, but who knows? Because that haven't come to fruition with the podcast or anything else that come to fruition with her and Toy Lanes. But when Angela E blocked her, I was like, okay, I am here for the block. Because when people say something negative, you can hit that block button real quick, fast, and her. So I was went over there in my little burner account. I'm like, what did she say? Obviously, she played a, a, a old video of a parody of the Breakfast Club when it was making fun of the Breakfast Club. I was like, "Was that the tweet that made her to get blocked?" I don't know. But anything if you know anything about Malaga Graham, she said something to get blocked. Okay, I'm just saying. Now, thank y'all so very much. Make sure y'all comment, like, and subscribe.